All right, so the first of the two containment plans, uh, the Truman Doctrine. Now, these containment plans are very important. You are going to need to know what the Truman Plan and what the Marshall, or I'm sorry, what the Truman Doctrine and what the Marshall Plan were. Um, these are the two main containment actions that were taken by the United States. The first one's called the Truman Doctrine, obviously based off the President Truman of the United States. Uh, basic definition, uh, the U.S. would provide... Uh, political, military, military, and economic assistance to all democratic nations under threat from external or internal forces. Uh, basically, anybody that's under communist threat, this could come from the Soviet Union directly, or this could be um, an internal threat from uh, small rebel groups or things that are kind of trying to rise up and take over a country, sort of the way Hitler did with Germany, um, uh, Stalin did in the Soviet Union, Mussolini in Italy, uh, Franco in Spain, Tojo in Japan, kind of leading into World War II. Um, this plan specifically, how this one's a little bit different than the Marshall Plan, which we'll get into next, um, this was focused basically on Greece and Turkey. And I tried to squeeze... Um, squeeze onto the map here if you notice at the bottom this is the same map that we were looking at before if you notice where greece and turkey are my thing keeps popping up on me at the bottom there they're very close um to that iron curtain uh, there's not a whole lot of room for greece down there and obviously you can see turkey is slightly behind it so protecting these two countries is incredibly important for the united states um, so that's where the main focus was. It was for Greece and Turkey, which is an important aspect of the Truman Doctrine that you're going to want to be able to know and remember. Um, and basically, we had to do this because the British, who, again, kind of devastated from World War II, were withdrawing their support for from Greece. And the U.S. feared that if they did that, that was going to kind of create a vacuum. And with that vacuum, that was going to open up an opportunity for uh, communism to take over in Turkey. <clears throat> excuse me, in Turkey and Greece. So the fear was we need to help those countries that are basically right on the line in order to kind of continue the containment of communism and to protect American interests. 